White House counsel Don McGahn reportedly does not believe his testimony to special counsel Robert Mueller implicated President Trump in any legal wrongdoing. The president said in an interview yesterday that he's worried about falling into a, quote, perjury trap if he talks to Mueller. Major Garrett is at the White House. Major, good morning. Good morning. Also in that interview with Reuters, the president said that the ongoing special counsel investigation, quote, played right into the Russians' hands. Also here in Washington, Republicans again expressed their concern about the president's unrelenting attacks on special counsel Robert Mueller. Have you briefed the White House on everything you told the special counsel? White House counsel Don McGahn dodged questions Monday about his role as a witness in the Russia investigation. President Trump called the probe a, quote, national disgrace. Mr. Trump made this claim about the special counsel's investigation. I can go in and I could do whatever. I could run it if I wanted, the president told Reuters. But I decided to stay out. The president's suggestion he could run an inquiry into his own conduct raised more questions about his understanding of obstruction of justice, an area of interest to Mueller. Mr. Trump also said he was reluctant to give an interview to Mueller because it could be a potential perjury trap, expressing fears that investigators could compare his version of the firing of James Comey against the notes and recollections of the former FBI director. It's my word against his, and he's best friends with Mueller, so Mueller might say, well, I believe Comey, and even if I'm telling the truth, that makes me a liar. That's no good. As he has before, Arizona Republican Jeff Flake said Mr. Trump was out of line. This is unseemly, frankly, to go after, uh, you know, career officers over at, uh, at Justice and uh, to go after Bob Mueller the way he's going after him. The president also told Reuters he might lift sanctions on Russia if there's cooperation from Moscow on Syria and Ukraine. Both seem highly unlikely cooperation and Congress going along with any lifting of Russia's sanctions. Bianca? Major, thanks.